you know your rod choice is extremely critical i think but you don't have to have a rod for each technique i, I like rods that have multiple uses or, or you know this is a six nine really really short rod but still a fast action rod but a medium action and what that short rod and the medium action allows me to do is cast light baits very accurately and still make a long cast I mean, this particular rod, it is awesome for, for like throwing a jerk bait like I'm doing now, but I can also cast like a balsa, like a shad wrap around with this rod. It's super accurate, you know, short, but powerful enough to get that big fish out of cover. And as you can see, I'm throwing a rip stop right now. And uh, you can tell by the action of this rod, really soft tip, really allows me to impart the right action on that bait to get those fish to bite. So there's three great uses for this one rod. So, uh, you know, I think a, a spinning rod's another perfect example, like a seven foot medium action spinning rod is good for so many, so many different things. You know, when you guys go shopping for a rod, you don't have to buy just a jerk bait rod, find a jerk bait rod that, that you can use for other things. You know, most of the time, as much as I like to have a flipping stick in my hand, most of the time that's not the case. I mean, I travel all around the country and I'm faced with a lot of different conditions. And, you know, I, there's a lot of times, like specifically in this instant where I'm target fishing, I wanna make very accurate casts and I really wanna set that bait on the water quietly. And that's what a shorter rod allows me to do. You know, I think a seven foot, this is a six nine, I think, you know, whether it's a spinning or a casting rod are some of the most versatile rods that you could possibly have. So uh, don't think you have to throw everything with giant line and a flipping stick. You know, a lot of times it's way easier to impart and put a better action on a bait with a shorter rod and a little bit lighter line. And that, at the end of the day, is more than likely gonna, gonna put more fish in your boat.